It's back to school for students at Campbell County. The first day outfit accessorized with a mask. I think this is what's going to help us stay in school. The goal this year is to stay in school all year long, face to face instruction, even if part of that face remains covered. We are ready. Masks really don't make a big deal, and it's going to help keep kids in school rather than having to use virtual instruction. That's our number one goal is we need kids in school in the building. Susan Edgley's son Landon is starting the first grade at Campbell Ridge Elementary. He is one of the many students too young to get vaccinated. She's happy for the clear messaging. I think that the school's taking care of it, and I'm glad that they introduced the mask before they went back to school for a couple weeks. Some students said they're not thrilled to be back to masks. Others say if it had to be a choice, theirs was clear. I would have worn it anyway. Senior Samantha Mays says it's not just about protecting her health. So you don't get sick. I don't want to get others sick. I have a I have a grandpa at home that has cancer, so I don't want to get him sick. Whether by choice or by mandate, masks are a go this school year. They can't hide the excitement to be together once again. We're just excited. I mean, we've been working um, all summer. We have been you know, making our plans and we're just ready to have kids back. Schools without kids in them are lonely places. So that mask mandate is in effect for 30 days, but again, it won't affect Campbell County schools since the district went ahead and made that decision to require them in buildings here. Reporting live in Campbell County, Molly Lair, WLWT News 5. Yeah, Molly, a lot of excitement surrounding the first day as always. Now, are there any times where those masks can be taken off? Just a few, Stephen. Uh, when you're eating, you can take them off. And then also we saw several classes outside today as they were playing for recess. The kids were able to go mask free. Stephen. All right, Molly, thank you so much. Live in Campbell County for us.